Ever wondered if you've been using common household items the right way? Many of us learn how to use something and stick with it. Well, it turns out there's a whole world of potential we might be missing out on. Join us as we uncover the mysteries of common household items you've been using wrong your whole life. It's time to work smarter, not harder, and discover a new perspective on the things you thought you knew inside out. Natural Peanut Butter Natural Peanut Butter, our everyday kitchen hero, makes awesome PB&NJ sandwiches and packs a protein punch for vegans and vegetarians. Now, for the health conscious among us, the allure lies in natural peanut butter, free from those pesky, artery-clogging hydrogenated oils. Yet, here's the catch. Storing and handling it right isn't as common as we think. Have you ever popped open a jar and found a pool of oil on top? That oil is a treasure trove of flavor, waiting to be mixed in. But let's admit it, stirring it up can be a bit of a kitchen dance. Fear not, for there's a trick to master this art. When you bring home that jar, flip it upside down. The oil will gracefully travel to the other end, making your stirring endeavors a breeze. No more messy spills on the counter or floor. So, as you embark on your peanut butter journey, savor every flip for a mess-free experience. Moving on to the next, spaghetti spoons. Have you ever stopped to wonder about the purpose of the hole in the middle of spaghetti spoons? Well, it turns out there's a clever reason behind it. That hole isn't just for show. It's actually a handy tool to help you measure the perfect serving of spaghetti per person. Imagine that. The idea is simple but genius. The hole is roughly the size of a single serving, allowing you to gauge just the right amount of spaghetti to cook for each person. So next time you're cooking up a pasta feast, let the hole in the spaghetti spoon be your guide to pasta perfection. Toblerone bars. Who doesn't love chocolates? With so many varieties and even some tempting fillings, chocolate bars come in a delightful array. Yet, one bar stands out among the rest for its unique look, the Toblerone. While others settle for mundane squares or slabs, this Swiss creation boasts distinctive triangles. Since 1908, it has captured hearts. But here's the kicker. Most people have been enjoying it the wrong way. The typical method involves grabbing a piece with your fingers and pulling it away. Sure, it works, but there's a better way. Treat it like a lighter, hold the bar, use your thumb to push a piece towards the rest, and let it snap off. It's a neater trick for your Toblerone indulgence. The next on the list is a really important one. Our beloved dishwasher. People often make mistakes with their dishwashers without realizing. Stuffing it too much with dirty dishes, putting utensils upside down, or rinsing plates before loading, which is not a good idea. Plus, many forget that you need to clean your dishwasher regularly for it to work right. If you don't, bits of food can get stuck in the filter, making the dishwasher struggle to drain and rinse properly, and your dishes might not come out as clean as you'd like. When loading your dishwasher, focus on placing the most soiled items at the center of the bottom rack, directing them toward the spray arm. Additionally, be vigilant about any obstructions to the detergent dispenser. If something sizable blocks it, the dispenser may not open correctly, causing problems with the proper dispensing of dishwasher detergent. Two-toned erasers. Ever wondered about those two-toned erasers lurking in your drawer? They aren't just a fun mix of colors. Each side has a specific job. The smooth pink end is your go-to for erasing pencil marks, offering a clean sweep. On the flip side, the gritty blue end is designed for battling ink stains. But here's the thing. The blue end works its magic only on erasable ink. If you try it on permanent ink, you might end up with more than erased words. It could rub a hole in your paper. So, let those two tones guide you to the right erasing technique. Plunger. Moreover, chances are, the plunger in your bathroom might not be the right one. That pink cup-shaped rubber plunger you use for the kitchen sink? Well, it's not the one your toilet needs. What you want is a plunger with a flange, that extra rubber part designed to fit in the drain and create an airtight seal. Along with the accordion plunger, this combo will tackle the dirty job effectively. Phone charger. 
So every night, I pop my phone on charge when I hit the hay, thinking I'm doing the right thing. Turns out, it's one of the not-so-great moves for my phone's battery. Oops! Experts say letting it charge overnight can speed up the aging process of the battery. Ideally, it's best to keep your battery between 30 and 50%. Now, that sounds good, but if you fear your phone might give up on you, maybe think about a portable charger. It'll keep your phone powered up during the day without going overboard. Bobby pins. Let's now talk bobby pins. If you're sliding them in with the grooved side facing up, like many folks do, here's a heads up. You might be missing out on their full potential. The grooves on bobby pins are cleverly designed to grip and secure hair, making sure it stays in place. Placing them with the grooved side up isn't as effective. It's like wearing your shoes on the wrong feet. They might still work, but not as well as they're meant to. So, the trick is to flip those bobby pins, grooved side down for a secure and stylish hold. Your hair game just got an upgrade. The grill. Hold on, grill masters. Before you don the title of grill master, let's fine tune a few things. Skip preheating the grill and you risk unevenly cooked meat. Not the goal. Also, don't fall for the assumption that every spot on the grill is created equal. Move your food from high heat to low heat zones at the right time for optimal results. If you're only sticking to direct heat, those open flames, brace yourself for burnt exteriors. Make friends with indirect heat spots for a safer cook. Oh, and resist the temptation to lift the lid every few minutes. Trust me, you're releasing precious heat and messing with your cooking time. Yogurt. Let me now help you upgrade your yogurt game. If you've been clumsily scooping honey or tossing fruit into your Greek yogurt, here's a game changer for you. No more messy toppings. Take that yogurt container, fold it in half, and watch the magic happen as your toppings gracefully pour right on top. It's like giving your yogurt a little open-air dance with its toppings. Say goodbye to the scoop and spill routine. Stainless steel pans. I'm all about non-stick pans. They're a breeze to use and a snap to clean. Now, stainless steel pans? Not exactly my go-to, or at least that's what I used to think. Turns out, there's a trick to rocking stainless steel pans effortlessly. Just season them first, like you would with a cast iron pan. A splash of oil, a touch of patience, and voila! Your stainless steel pans will be as slick as your beloved non-stick ones. Who knew? Now let's shift from kitchen adventures to earbud escapades. Earbud. We're diving into those little wonders you pop into your ears for a private music session. Earbuds, the compact alternative to bulky headphones, have become a common sight. However, there's a hitch. Many folks shove them in without much thought, and surprise, they tend to slip out. Fear not, there's an easy fix. Instead of a straight plunge, loop the earbud over the top of your ear from behind. The result? The wire gracefully hangs down, putting less pressure on the earbud, snugly keeping it in place despite any ear wiggles or gravity conspiracies. Earbud troubles, be gone. Well, that was all for today, folks. Which newfound knowledge was the most useful for you? Whether it's mastering the art of seasoning stainless steel pans or discovering the secret to keeping your earbuds snug, these life hacks are here to make your daily routine smoother. So which one will become your go-to trick? Let me know in the comments below. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more fun videos. See you in the next one.